What's up, everybody? My name is Matt, aka The Constant, and Fortnite Chapter 2, Season 5, Week 7 has begun. As usual, a new week means new quests, and the quest that we're looking at today's video is visit houses in Slurpee Swamp in one match. Now, I'm going to show you guys exactly where these houses are in Slurpee Swamp, but first, I got to ask, are you guys new to the channel? Because if you are, and even if you're not, leave a like on the video and consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed. Because we're on road to 4,000 subscribers, your help is greatly appreciated. Big thank you to everyone showing support on the channel. You guys are all amazing. If you guys would like to support me even further, you guys can use code the constant, all one word in the Fortnite item shop. Thank you to everyone using my code. You guys are all awesome. Also, I showed this in the other challenge video I released today, but if you go to your settings, go to the top, click this right here and scroll a little bit down. You will see disable pre-edit option. I turned that on. I'm so happy that this is finally an option in Fortnite. If you guys also want to disable your pre-edits, all you got to do is come over here and turn it on. Now, without further ado, let's jump in game and I'll show you guys exactly where to find these houses in Slurpee Swamp. All right, so here we are in game at good old Slurpee Swamp. Now the challenge takes to visit three different houses in Slurpee Swamp. A lot of people would just land here and go into different buildings, but these buildings are not the houses you are looking for. Rather, the houses that you're looking for are on the outskirts of Slurpee Swamp itself. Now, if you go towards the south side of Slurpee Swamp like so, you will see these little houses around the swamp, like this one. Now, I'm making this video a day before the challenges go live, so I'm not 100% sure if something this small will count as a house. If not, you might have to find something bigger. So if you go towards Flush Factory over here, you will see something bigger, a house looking like this. Again, these houses are located on the edge of Slurpee Swamp, so this one right over here may or may not count. It might be too far. This is the one that we were at before. If neither of those count, you might have to go a little bit further to the west of Slurpee Swamp, and this right here might count as your house. This one over here to the west of this one looks like an actual house, and if you go inside, you have yourself a little cozy setting. And after this house over here, you can kind of keep going around the edge of Slurpee Swamp. There's a lot of broken down houses and buildings around the area, so if one doesn't work, keep going around the circle. If these work, this might be your best location to land to complete this challenge. Over here, you will find a bunch of houses or huts all together, and there's a bunch of slurp barrels around here as well. This location is found to the westmost side on the map, over here, almost directly south of Slurpee Swamp. Let me know if you guys know what this is actually called. It's a landmark in game. If you guys know what this landmark is called, I will heart your comment down below. Let me know in the comments. Either way, that's it for this video. If you guys found it helpful or enjoyable, remember to leave a like and consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed. We are on the road to 4,000 subscribers. So your help is always appreciated. Big thank you to everyone showing support on the channel. You guys are all amazing. Before the end of the video, I just want to give a shout out to our amazing channel members right over there. Our super constant tier, our ascended constant tier, and our master constant tier. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much for all that you guys do for the channel. Your support is so appreciated. Thank you guys for watching. Best of luck with the rest of your week seven quests and I'll see you guys in the next one.